Hello there, this is Space Number 5. Welcome back to episode 33 of Cars, where today we're playing again our German US deck against a Japanese player. Definitely like having the M7 Priest. Don't, well, actually, the Wildcat might be good in case they're rushing. You know, it's been so long since I've seen a Sherman, I didn't know we had one in our deck anymore. <laughs> Let's go and get rid of the 7th Regiment and the Get rid of the M7 Priest just for now. Uh, Stuka, still not huge fond, or very fond of having in the deck. I'm pretty sure I'll remove it. Just because it... As a bomber, we haven't really utilized it as such. The howitzer draw is very nice, actually, in case it's a Japanese rush deck. Though, they didn't have any one drops, so I'm, I don't think that's what this is. Might be a Japanese air. Japanese British air. Could be interesting. Just wait to see what his card is. <laughs> He's thinking. Ooh, his own 1 3 artillery. Your, your units that attack or are attacked by the Type 93 are pinned. Well, we don't have any, uh, oh, we do have air units, uh, no, we're not going to play any, moment. We can go ahead and do some trading with artillery, be kind of cute, cheeky. And the next turn we'll go ahead and drop our nice 3-6. Ooh, 2-1 with blitz. Deal 2 damage to a random enemy. That could be concerning. Because he could definitely walk forward. Um, do we disconnect? Is oh no, he is still he's still going. Okay, that's okay if you stay there. We can go ahead and attack one more turn. Just gonna drop the nice five five with smoke screen on the battlefield, just so that way he can uh. He's kind of like a deflector, basically, of just like, hey, go home. <laughs> we don't want you in this front line. That's ours. Um, so he can do one damage. Oh, he is a Soviet-Japanese player. That's not good. So yeah, he is going to kill us. Hmm. It's kind of one of the benefits of knowing what your opponent has. 2-1 with Blitz. Yep, yeah, now he's got all of his... Uh, his rushing units. So what we will do... Go ahead and hit here, and then we fully repair. Just do the additional... T oh, I went to the HQ instead. Repair this guy. He's now 5-5 five, five once again. And we're going to get ready to start walking across the, uh, the front line. Trade with a 3-3, three, three, march with a 5-5. Five, five. And probably that's three, so we'll have three left. And I guess we'll drop the three six infantry. Unless we need a repair where he focuses like the five five. Which could it's definitely possible. He's got seven cards. This would be a good time for uh, the Japanese. I think it's what the rising sun to draw two cards. Destruction deal two damage to HQ. This guy. So it is a Japanese burn deck. Okay. <laughs> Good fully repair this guy just so he lives. Kind of funny. Two damage to the HQ. Repair this guy. He lives. Go ahead and trade. So now his artillery will target this guy. And we're going to take the front line, for sure. Well, actually, that's not for sure. He has a lot of blitz units. It's the Japanese we're talking about. Hmm. I haven't seen any Soviet units other than the Bloody Sickle. Hmm. I 
just have six credits. I think the, what, the Osaka guard with 4-7 with guard would be very nice for him, actually, here. Naval, nope. Naval operation. Everything's pinned. There went one of our units. We were looking forward to taking the front line this turn. Do have the Stuka, though. And a bloody sickle. So we would like to repair this guy if we can. Oh, nope, he's gone. Why didn't you play this guy earlier? The howitzer. Could do a howitzer combo. Just stun everything and drop the howitzer. Yeah, why don't we do that, actually? Give our HQ smokescreen. I mean, he can still pin it with this guy, but it's not what we're uh, necessarily looking for. We're going to destroy his artillery, march to the front line, drop to Sherman. Because this guy's probably going to be pinned. 2 3 at Blitz. Nice 3 3 now. Definitely trade with this guy, though uh, we don't get the benefit of the Sherman. I think he's trying to think of a way out to save his artillery. Nice 1 1 again. Oof. Didn't have to do any damage, though. Or actually make that work. It's going to deny us the front line. No biggie. Do you have another artillery? There goes his artillery piece. We will gladly trade here. Two damage to the HQ. And drop down the 3-6. So he's probably actually going to try and trade the Type 93 for our, uh, our Wildcat, is my guess. It's not a bad trade. You know, one drop for a uh, three drop. We do have two artillery pieces, which is pretty threatening, honestly. Two damage to a random enemy. Could just do a really big sweep to artillery. Although we might, they might hit the uh, Wildcat with the additional two damage, which... Honestly, isn't that big of a deal to us. Do have a Stuka for to help remove his cards, which this might only honestly be the uh, one time we actually use the Stuka for its intended purpose. Otherwise, for the most part, it's just cannon fodder. Having the artillery with ambush is very nice against a bunch of one drops or one health units. Excuse me. Hmm. Ooh, 4 4 with ambush. That'll definitely cause uh, some hurt. Another Sherman. Hmm. Just drop everything's attack. This will get rid of the. Oh, well. This guy will not get rid of the ambush, but. Go ahead and hit this guy. Two damage on the howitzer. It's not the best thing in the world. Get rid of the type 93. You still have ambush, so we'll just hit the HQ. That'll be fine. You'll probably attack my uh, Bobcat with your zero. There, you might hit the artillery, honestly. It's definitely an option. Four three, heavy armor. When the shooting is destroyed, deal excess damage to enemy HQ. Oof. One three. All right, same thing. Got lots of Shermans. Dang. Go and take the front. Yeah. 
say goodbye to your zero. Can't ground you. Never drop a Stuka. For cannon fodder. <laughs> <laughs> The 4-3 bomber is a little bit of a, uh, a nuisance, but is this guy going to target him? Oh, there goes our howitzer. No question about that one. You gonna trade for the front line? You are interesting. It's not what I expected. Say goodbye to your bomber. the Sherman for card draw. What we can do is very nice at this point. Dang. Go ahead and hit you. I think that's an okay trade. Get rid of that zero. I think that's worth it just leaving the one three artillery and he only has three cards. Should be worth it, especially when we have card draw and then a form of card removal. 2-3 with Blitz. Deals 2 damage to HQ, sure. Go ahead and hit the, uh, the Sherman, that's fine. I don't know if I said GG this game. I don't remember. 3-3 three, three deal. Undestruction deal damage to HQ. It's okay. Do you have the front line. Drop down on the Sherman. More card draw. It's very nice. I think we just do a we can do it. HP. Try the tiger at this point. Just go for the HQ some more. One damage. We have a nearly full hand at this point. Six cards. Pretty good. There are two. Our board is significantly more developed. You gonna throw everything else at it? 3-3 three, three in? No, that's just on the HQ. That's fine. Let's get another one. Okay. Fortunately, we do have 12 damage. Go ahead and give a good game. Okay, well, that's today's game. If you enjoyed it, please like and subscribe. Have a good day.